Hey everyone, it's Danielle Johnson here, your executive director, and I just kind of wanted to give you some ideas for vendor events. So first of all, you can see I've got it focused here on a sign that I have gotten from Vistaprint. Now, this is something that you want to save for. I will say that with the stand and the sign itself that I spent you know, around $75, and it's not really necessary, but it definitely adds some height. So when you're looking at my whole space here, which is a bigger than normal space, which we'll talk about in a minute, you can see that it adds height, which is always really nice. Okay, so I, if I use a chair, I like to cover it. Not again, super important, but look at how it just kind of dresses it up. Super easy. You could take a piece of material, a blanket, um, mine is a tablecloth, I have extra. Okay, so we're gonna come back to the thermals. We're gonna focus on some of the th parts that are the most important part. And that is your kit, if you have one. If you don't have a kit, have no fear. But if you do, it is so important that you are showcasing that kit as one thing and that you've got some little subtle hints about it being $99. So as you can see from me, I have it all on the black tablecloth. So if someone says, what's $99? I can very easily show it to them and say, it's everything that you see on the black tablecloth. That's kind of a little way that I do it, okay? The other thing that's really important with um, a vendor event is a giveaway. Now, depending on the size of the um, vendor event, you know, it varies on how big your giveaway is gonna be. I have a medium utility tote and a stand tall, and we all know that those go in the vault, and people who love 31 are, you know, they've been oohing and on over it all day. Okay, and then here are my slips, and some wording that I use is that I, you know, I say, you know, I'm doing a giveaway, that there is no purchase necessary, but you do need to fill out the entire form, and you're gonna stick it in here, and that's what we're winning today. Okay, and then you can see I do have a sign down here and the skirt. Now, this is a no-no. You can see things under my table right now and that is actually not pretty. We don't wanna do that. So I need to tuck those under a little bit better, okay? It's not huge no-no, but it does make it not look quite as pretty. Okay, then I have my hostess exclusives, kind of all in a little section today because, you know, for March, we have all of these rolling things. And then on the other side of the table, I have um, these, the bins as well. Now, one of the things that I'm doing today because I really wanna focus on home parties is if they book a home party, they're getting to pick something out of the bin and I will give it to them at their party, okay? What else do we have going? So if they fill out their entire form, I am actually giving them a mini catalog, making sure that they have my information on the back. I always like to ask if they have a consultant. Gives me an idea, and I always mention, I'm not here to step on any toes. But if you don't, that this is my full-time job, I'm not going anywhere, and I would love to be your 31 consultant. Now, if they fill this out completely, I'm also giving them a gift. For me, it's these little mirrors, again, with my information, because I want them to keep this forever and ever. And remember that I'm their 31 lady, okay? Now, I got lucky and I got these mirrors on clearance, really cheap, but some other ideas of things that you can use that I use, um, go to the dollar store, get an eight pack of Kleenexes, put your label on it, get sand hand sanitizers, anything that's gonna cost you like 10 to 20 cents, okay? Then, of course, we have a section always with our monthly specialist. So this month, it's purses, as you guys know. So I made sure that I have a nice section that shows the straps, it shows the choices of the purses. I have it laid out here that they can see Studio, Studio 31. I have my magnet board along with a sign showing that purses are half off. And then I have some more purses hung here, okay? Now, again, remember that this is a really large booth that I have right now. Generally, you're gonna get an eight by eight or a 10 by 10. I splurged and I spent twice as much because I love to have more space. So I always like to add height. So you can see I've got these cubes on Amazon. It shows our close to home trays. I've got some of our beach bags and I kind of have a theme here that you can see. So, you know, 31 is Proverbs 31. So you can see that I kind of um, stayed with that theme. I have a thermal section over here. And again, it's always nice to use heights. So there's where some more pink boxes come in. If you hadn't noticed, I used the pink box with the kit. And then these people are over here looking, you're fine, you're fine. They're over here looking and I have another colorful section. So I wanted to showcase some more of the colorful stuff that we have. Then I have little stuff down on the floor. Don't be afraid to use the floor. So this has some remaining bags in this deluxe utility tote. This bin has some of the small bags. This is my personal Cindy tote, so it's super handy, so I can be ready, but you have no idea how many ladies have been swooning over that Cindy tote already. 
And then I have a hamper over here, and again, it has all the remaining bags in it so that I don't have to have everything out. So I just kind of wanted to give you guys some ideas. I'll give you the big picture here again. Keeping in mind, this is a really large booth. Um, they were $25 for the 10 by 10, so I splurged and went ahead and spent 50 because like I said, I love being spread out. I love having room for my customers to be able to look and not feel like I'm pestering them and that they have room to move. So just kind of want to give you guys an idea. Hopefully this helps you guys. Again, I'm going to show you some things that I look at my skirts. See my table skirts should go lower to the ground. Okay. That's something that I need to work on. All right, guys. Have a great day.